So with that, I'd like to turn things over to Commissioner Lambert. Thank you, Dr. Shaw. Today, the Maine Department of Health and Human Services is announcing its strategy to distribute 400,000 rapid COVID-19 antigen tests to ensure access for Maine residents. The test can detect coronavirus infection from a nasal swab sample in approximately 15 minutes. Maine has already built a robust and successful testing strategy that helps us lead the nation in the fight against the COVID-19 pandemic. The addition of the Binex Now rapid antigen tests will provide a new layer of protection for Maine people. These tests are for people with symptoms of COVID-19. We are also initially will test people at elevated risk of exposure to and illness from COVID-19 who are critical infrastructure staff. This means healthcare workers, law enforcement, and public safety personnel, first responders, and school staff. This also includes correctional facilities, which Commissioner Liberty can talk about. The federal government is distributing the Abbott Binex Now COVID-19 point of care antigen tests to all 50 states and the District of Columbia. Maine expects to receive 400,000 of these tests by December. We are newly partnering with Walgreens to distribute the bulk of the tests, approximately 300,000, through 65 pharmacy locations from Kittery to Madawaska. This testing will be available to the public at no charge at drive-through sites starting in November. The remaining 100,000 by next now tests will be distributed through an application process. Any qualified organization that follows the state's guidance may apply now for an allocation. The department will prioritize facilities that will use them for high-risk populations in high-risk settings or where access to COVID-19 testing is otherwise limited. In addition to the 400,000 tests allocated to Maine, the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services has also distributed these Binex Now tests directly to congregate care settings, such as nursing and assisted living facilities throughout the state. Even without accounting though for these Binex Now tests, Maine's testing capacity leads the nation. This capacity, which is 528% of Maine's testing target, according to the Harvard Global Health Institute, is the result of a deal Governor Mills reached with Maine-based IDEX laboratories about five months ago. That agreement, as well as partnerships with Maine healthcare organizations and exceptional work by the state's health and environmental testing laboratory, allows Maine to be one of the first states in the nation to eliminate its testing prioritization. We also have a standing order that allows anyone in Maine who thinks they need a test to get one. Maine has established more than two dozen swab and send testing locations that offer molecular testing at no charge. Swab and send sites complement the roughly 40 sites throughout the state that are available to the public. For a list of where you can get tested, go to the Keep Maine Healthy website. And with that, I'll turn it back over to Dr. Shaw. Great, thank you, Commissioner Lambrew. Uh, we'll now turn to our 